The 1980 Summer Olympics, officially known as the Games of the 22nd Olympiad Russian, Igri 22 Olibady, tr. Igri 22 Olibady, was an international multi-sport event held in Moscow, Soviet Union, in present-day Russia. The 1980 Games were the first Olympic Games to be staged in Eastern Europe, and remain the only Summer Olympics held there, as well as the first Olympic Games to be held in a Slavic-language-speaking country. They were also the first Olympic Games to be held in a communist country until 2008 in China and the second in a developing country after the 1968 Summer Olympics in Mexico. These were the final Olympic Games under the IOC presidency of Michael Morris, 3rd Baron Kilinan. Eighty nations were represented at the Moscow Games, the smallest number since 1956. Led by the United States, 66 countries boycotted the Games entirely because of the Soviet-Afghan War. Some athletes from some of the boycotting countries they are not included in the list of 66 countries that boycotted the Games entirely, participated in the Games under the Olympic flag. The Soviet Union would later boycott the 1984 Summer Olympics. Topic. Host city selection The only two cities to bid for the 1980 Summer Olympics were Moscow and Los Angeles. The choice between them was made on 23 October 1974 in the 75th IOC session in Vienna, Austria. Los Angeles would eventually host the 1984 Summer Olympics. Topic. Participation overview and boycott Eighty nations were represented at the Moscow Games, the smallest number since 1956. Of the 80 participating nations, eight nations made their first appearance at this Games, Angola, Botswana, Cyprus, Laos, Mozambique, Nicaragua, and Seychelles. None of these nations won a medal. Although approximately half of the 24 countries that boycotted the 1976 Summer Olympics in protest against the IOC not expelling New Zealand who sanctioned a rugby tour of apartheid South Africa, participated in the Moscow Games, the 1980 Summer Olympics were disrupted by another, even larger, boycott led by the United States in protest at the 1979 Soviet-Afghan War. The Soviet invasion spurred Jimmy Carter to issue an ultimatum on 20 January 1980, that the U.S. would boycott the Moscow Olympics if Soviet troops did not withdraw from Afghanistan within one month. Sixty-five countries and regions invited did not take part in the 1980 Olympics. Many of these followed the United States boycott initiative, while others cited economic reasons for not coming. Iran, under Ayatollah Khomeini hostile to both superpowers, boycotted when the Islamic Conference condemned the invasion. Many of the boycotting nations participated instead in the Liberty Bell Classic, also known as the Olympic Boycott Games, in Philadelphia. However, the nations that did compete had won 71% of all medals, and similarly 71% of the gold medals, at the 1976 Summer Olympics in Montreal. This was in part because of state-run doping programs that had been developed in the Eastern Bloc countries. As a form of protest against the Soviet intervention in Afghanistan, 15 countries marched in the opening ceremony with the Olympic flag instead of their national flags, and the Olympic flag and Olympic hymn were used at medal ceremonies when athletes from these countries won medals. Competitors from three countries, New Zealand, Portugal, and Spain, competed under the flags of their respective national Olympic committees. Some of these teams that marched under flags other than their national flags were depleted by boycotts by individual athletes. While some athletes did not participate in the march, the impact of the boycott was mixed. Some events, such as swimming, track and field, boxing, basketball, diving, field hockey, and equestrian sports, were hard hit. Whilst competitors from 36 countries became Olympic medalists, the great majority of the medals were taken by the host country and East Germany in what was the most skewed medal tally since 1904. Topic. Events, records and drug tests overview There were 203 events, more than at any previous Olympics. 36 world records, 39 European records and 74 Olympic records were set at the Games. In total, this was more records than were set at Montreal. New Olympic records were set 241 times over the course of the competitions and world records were beaten 97 times. A 1989 report by a committee of the Australian Senate claimed that, "...there is hardly a medal winner at the Moscow Games, certainly not a gold medal winner who is not on one sort of drug or another, usually several kinds. The Moscow Games might well have been called the Chemists' Games." 
a member of the IOC Medical Commission, Manfred Donica, privately ran additional tests with a new technique for identifying abnormal levels of testosterone by measuring its ratio to epitestosterone in urine. 20% of the specimens he tested, including those from 16 gold medalists would have resulted in disciplinary proceedings had the tests been official. The results of Donike's unofficial tests later convinced the IOC to add his new technique to their testing protocols. The first documented case of blood doping occurred at the 1980 Summer Olympics as a runner was transfused with two pints of blood before winning medals in the 5,000 meters and 10,000 meters. Topic: <laughs> Media and broadcasting. Major broadcasters of the games were USSR State TV and Radio 1,370 accreditation cards, Eurovision, 31 countries, 818 cards, and Intervision, 11 countries, 342 cards. TV Asahi with 68 cards provided coverage for Japan, while OTI representing Latin America received 59 cards and the 7 Network provided coverage for Australia, 48 cards. NBC, which had intended to be another major broadcaster, cancelled its coverage in response to the U.S. boycott of the 1980 Summer Olympics, and became a minor broadcaster with 56 accreditation cards, although the network did air highlights and recaps of the games on a regular basis. ABC aired scenes of the opening ceremony during its Nightline program, and promised highlights each night, but the next night, the show announced that they could not air any highlights as NBC still had exclusive broadcast rights in the USA. The Canadian Broadcasting Corporation almost cancelled their plans for coverage after Canada took part in the boycott and was represented by nine cards. The television centre used 20 television channels, compared to 16 for the Montreal Games, 12 for the Munich Games, and 7 for the Mexico City Games. During the opening ceremony, Salyut 6 crew Leonid Popov and Valerie Ryuman sent their greetings to the Olympians and wished them happy starts in the live communication between the station and the central Lenin Stadium. They appeared on the stadium scoreboard and their voices were translated via loudspeakers. Topic: Spectators and commemoration. The games attracted 5 million spectators, an increase of 1.5 million from the Montreal Games. There were 1245 referees from 78 countries. A series of commemorative coins was released in the USSR in 1977 to 1980 to commemorate the event. It consisted of five platinum coins, six gold coins, 28 silver coins and six copper nickel coins. Topic. Budget According to the official report, submitted to the IOC by the NOC of the USSR, total expenditures for the preparations for and staging of the Games were States dollars total revenues being States dollars Cost The Oxford Olympic study established the outturn cost of the Moscow 1980 Summer Olympics at $6.3 billion in 2015 dollars. This includes sports-related costs only, that is, I, operational costs incurred by the organizing committee for the purpose of staging the Games, e.g., expenditures for technology, transportation, workforce, administration, security, catering, ceremonies, and medical services, and I, I, direct capital costs incurred by the host city and country or private investors to build, e.g., the competition venues, the Olympic Village, International Broadcast Center, and Media and Press Center, which are required to host the Games. Indirect capital costs are not included, such as for road, rail, or airport infrastructure, or for hotel upgrades or other business investment incurred in preparation for the Games but not directly related to staging the Games. The cost for Moscow 1980 compares with costs of US$4.6 billion for Rio 2016, US$40 States dollars minus US$44 billion for Beijing 2008 and US$51 billion United States dollars for Sochi 2014, the most expensive Olympics in history. Average cost for the Summer Games since 1960 is US$5.2 billion. United States dollars. Topic. Opening ceremony Topic. Highlights of the different events Topic. Archery 
Tomi Pikolainen of Finland, who had not finished any of the previous three days shooting higher than fourth, came from fourth on the last day to win the men's archery competition, scoring 2,455 points. He won gold just three points ahead of a Soviet. The women's archery gold was won by Ketevan Luzabarids USSR, who was also the world, European and Soviet champion. The women's archery silver was won by Natalia Butuzova USSR. In 1979, she had set nine national records and three world records. The U.S. archery team was one of the strongest ever fielded but due to the boycott the team never had a chance to prove itself. This team held every record and featured 1976 Olympic champion Daryl O'Pace, who was averaging 100 points more than the winning score in Moscow at the time. Athletics Ethiopian Mirats Yifta won the 5,000m and 10,000m athletics double, emulating Las Viren's 1972 and 1976 performances. I have a 90% chance of winning the 1,500m," wrote Steve Ovet in an article he did for one of Britain's Sunday papers just before the start of the Olympics. After he won the 800m Olympic gold, beating world record holder Sebastian Coe, Ovet stated that he would not only win the 1,500m race, but would beat the world record by as much as four seconds. Ovet had won 45 straight 1,500m races since May 1977. In contrast Coe had competed in only eight 1,500 meters races between 1976 and 1980. Coe won the race, holding off Ovette in the final lap. Ovette finished third. Aided by the absence of American opposition, Alan Wells beat Cuban Silvio Leonard to become the first Briton since 1924 to win the Olympic 100 meters race. Gerd Wessig, who had made the East German team only two weeks before the Games, easily won the gold medal with a 2.36 m high jump. This was 9 cm higher than he had ever jumped before. In the 1980 Olympic women's long jump competition Soviet jumper, Tatiana Kolpakova, bested her compatriots and other competitors by setting a new Olympic record of 7.06 m Poland's Vladislav Kozakovich won the pole vault with a jump of 5.78 meters, 19 feet 0 in, only the second pole vaulting world record to be established during an Olympics. The previous time had been at the Antwerp Olympics 1920. In the long jump competition, three women beat 23 feet, 7.0 meters for the first time ever in one competition. Waldemar Siepinski of the German Democratic Republic, East Germany, won his second consecutive marathon gold. Barbel Wackel, also of the GDR, winner of the 200m in Montreal, became the first woman to retain the title. Tatiana Kazankina USSR retained the 1,500m title that she had won in Montreal. In the women's pentathlon the Soviet Nadezhda Tachenko present-day Ukraine scored 5,083 points to become the first athlete to exceed 5,000 points in the event during Olympic competition, she won gold. For the first time in the history of the Olympics all eight male participants in the long jump final beat the mark of 8 meters 26 feet 3 in. Lutz Dombrovsky GDR won the long jump gold. His was the longest jump recorded at sea level and he became only the second ever to jump further than 28 feet 8.5 meters. In the triple jump final Viktor Sanyayev USSR, present-day Georgia, who won gold at Mexico, Munich and Montreal won silver behind Yak Uudme USSR, present-day Estonia, and ahead of Brazil's world record holder João Carlos de Oliveira. Both de Oliveira and Australia's Ian Campbell produced long jumps, but they were declared fouls by the officials and not measured. In Campbell's case, his longest jump was ruled a scrape foul, with his trailing leg touching the track during the jump. Campbell insisted he hadn't scraped, and it was alleged the officials intentionally threw out his and de Oliveira's best jumps to favor the Soviets, similarly to a number of other events. Yuri Sedaik USSR, won gold in the hammer throw event. Four of his six throws broke the world record of 80 meters. No hammer thrower in the world had ever achieved this before. As in Montreal the USSR won gold, silver and bronze in this event. Evelyn Jarl GDR, the 1976 Olympic champion won discus gold again. She won with a new Olympic record 69.96 meters 229 feet 6 in. She had been undefeated since Montreal. Cuba's Maria Caridad Colon won the women's javelin setting a new Olympic record. Sara Simeone of Italy won the women's high jump, setting a new Olympic record. She had won a silver in the 1976 Games and would go on to win a silver in the 1984 Games. 
In track and field six world records, 18 Olympic records and nine best results of the year were registered. In women's track and field events alone either a world or Olympic record was broken in almost every event. Daly Thompson of Great Britain won the gold in the decathlon. He won gold again at the Los Angeles Olympics. Soviet Danis Kula won gold in the men's javelin. He also had the best sum total of throws, showing his consistency. He finished ahead of his teammate Alexander Makarov. Polish gold medalist Paul Volta Vladislav Kozakowicz showed an obscene brass donor gesture in all four directions to the jeering Soviet public, causing an international scandal and almost losing his medal as a result. There were numerous incidents and accusations of Soviet officials using their authority to negate marks by opponents to the point that IAAF officials found the need to look over the officials' shoulders to try to keep the events fair. There were also accusations of opening stadium gates to advantage Soviet athletes, and causing other disturbances to opposing athletes. Topic. Basketball Basketball was one of the hardest hit sports due to the boycott. Though replacements were found, five men's teams including the defending Olympic champion United States withdrew from the competition in addition to the U.S. women's team. In the women's competition, the host Soviet Union won the competition beating Bulgaria for gold, Yugoslavia won bronze. The men's competition featured only the second instance of the U.S. men's basketball team not winning gold with the first one being in Munich. Yugoslavia took home the gold beating Italy in the final. The hosts, Soviet Union, winners in 1972, won the bronze. Topic. Boxing Teofilo Stevenson of Cuba became the first boxer to win three consecutive Olympic titles in heavyweight, and indeed the only boxer to win the same event in three games. Laszlo Papp from Hungary was the first boxer to win three titles. In boxing Cuba won six gold, two silvers and two bronzes. The Val Barker Trophy is presented by the AIBA to the competitor adjudged to be the best stylist at the games. The winner was Patricio Oliver of Italy who won gold at light welterweight. Topic. Canoeing Yuladzimir Parfianovich of the USSR won three gold medals in canoeing. Apart from the boycotted Los Angeles Olympics Birgit Fischer of East Germany won medals in each Olympics from 1980 to 2004. In the 500m kayak singles she won gold in Moscow, silver in Seoul, gold in Barcelona. Topic. Cycling. Lothar Toms of East Germany won the 1,000-meter individual pursuit cycling gold, breaking the world record by nearly four seconds. The winner of the bronze in that race was Jamaica's David Weller who also broke the 16-year-old world record. In the 4,000-meter team pursuit qualifying heats new world indoor records were set eight times. The 189-kilometer individual road race gold was won by Sergei Sukorushenkov, USSR. The cycling team road race was won by the Soviet team as they had done in Munich and Montreal. In cycling world records were toppled 21 times. Topic. Diving As Alexander Portnov waited to do a two-and-one-half reverse somersault in the springboard final, cheers broke out in three adjoining swimming pool during the closing stages of Salonov's world record breaking 1,500 meters swim. The diver delayed his start until the noise had subsided but, as he took his first steps along the board, even greater cheers broke out as Salnikov touched in under 15 minutes. Under the rules Portnov, having started, could not stop before takeoff. On protest to the Swedish referee Giolander he was allowed to repeat the dive and went ahead again of Mexico's Carlos Giron. Later protests by Mexico against the re-dive and by East Germany that their Falk Hoffman wanted to re-dive after allegedly being disturbed by photographic flashlights were both turned down by FINA. FINA president Javier Osters stated that the decision taken by the Swedish referee was the correct one. FINA assessed all the Olympic diving events and considers the judging to have been objective. Portnov remained the winner with Giron taking silver and Cagnato of Italy bronze. Martina Jaschka, East Germany, was fourth after the preliminary high dives, but came back to win gold on the second day of competition. Irina Kalinina, USSR, won gold in the springboard final. 
As a result of her 10 dives in the preliminaries she amassed a unique number of points, 478.86. In the previous four years no diver had scored so many. In this final the Mexican judge A. Marsicle allowed Karen Gufka East Germany, to retake a dive. Topic. Equestrian In the individual show jumping event Poland's Jan Kowalczyk and the USSR's Nikolai Korokov each had eight faults, but Kowalczyk won gold as his horse completed the course the quicker. So Poland won the last of the 203 gold medals contested. The oldest medalist at the Moscow Olympics was Petra Roska Romania, in the dressage at 57 years 283 days. Topic. Fencing France took four gold medals in fencing. In the Team Sabre fencing final, for the fifth Olympics in a row, Italy and the USSR met. The USSR won as they did in Tokyo, Mexico and Montreal. Topic. Football The USSR won bronze. Czechoslovakia won the gold medal beating German Democratic Republic East Germany 1 to 0 in the final. The matches were played in Moscow and Leningrad and in Kiev and Minsk in the Ukrainian SSR and Belarusian SSR respectively. Topic gymnastics Soviet gymnast Alexander Dichitin won a medal in each of the eight gymnastics events including three titles. He was the first athlete to win eight medals at an Olympics. He scored several tens, the first perfect scores in men's gymnastics since the 1924 Paris Olympics. Nikolai Andrianov who had won gold on floor at both Munich and Montreal was pipped this time by Roland Bruckner of East Germany. Andrianov retained the vault title he had won in Montreal. Zoltan Magyar, Hungary, retained the Olympic title on pommel horse that he had won in Montreal. He was also three times world champion and three times European champion on this piece of apparatus. In the team competition the USSR won the gold medal for the eighth consecutive time, continuing the gold series that started in 1952. In the women's gymnastics event finals, a Romanian gymnast medals on each piece of apparatus for the first time, balance beam, Nadia Comaneci, gold, floor, Nadia Comaneci, gold, uneven bar, Amelia Eboli, silver, and Melita Rune, bronze bolt, Melita Rune, bronze before the Los Angeles Olympics. The United States Gymnastics Federation proposed a change in the rules so that a head judge cannot interfere and meddle in the scoring of competitors. Topic. Handball In the men's event East Germany beat the USSR 23–22 in the handball final. In the women's tournament USSR won all its matches and retained the Olympic handball title. Yugoslavia and East Germany gained silver and bronze medal respectively. Topic. Field hockey Six countries competed in the women's field hockey, Austria, India, Poland, Czechoslovakia, USSR, and Zimbabwe. The gold medal was won by the team of Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe did not learn it would get a place in the tournament until 35 days before the games began and chose its team only the weekend before the opening ceremony. None of their players had prior playing experience on an artificial surface. Soviet Union won bronze. India won a record eighth title in men's field hockey. The Soviet Union won bronze. Topic. Judo In Japan's absence, the USSR won five medals. Topic. Modern pentathlon In the modern pentathlon George Horvath Sweden recorded a perfect score in the pistol shoot. It had been achieved only once before, at the 1936 Olympics. Topic. Rowing East Germany dominated rowing, winning 11 of the 14 titles. The East German men won 7 out of 8 events, followed from achieving a clean sweep by Perti Karpinen of Finland, who defended his Olympic title from Montreal. East German women won 4 of their 6 events. In the rowing eights with Coxon the British team win silver just 0.74 seconds behind East Germany. Topic. Sailing 
Sailing event was held in Tallinn, Soviet occupied Estonia. Soviet sailor Valentin Mankin won a gold medal in Star class. He won Olympic champion titles in Finn and Tempest classes before, and as of 2007 remains the only sailor in Olympic history to win gold medals in three different classes. Shooting The three-day skeet shooting marathon was won by Hans K. Geld Rasmussen of Denmark. In the small bore rifle, prone event, Hungarian Karoli Varga captured the gold and equaled the world record. Swimming Vladimir Salnikov USSR, won three gold medals in swimming. He became the first man in history to break the 15-minute barrier in the 1,500 meters freestyle, swimming's equivalent of breaking the 4-minute mile. He missed the 1984 games because of the boycott but won gold again in this event at Seoul 1988. Salnikov also won gold in the 4 times 200 meters relay and the 400 meters freestyle. In the 400 meters freestyle he set a new Olympic record which was just 11 hundredths of a second outside his own world record. In the Montreal final of the 400 meters freestyle the 7th and 8th place finalists finished in over 4 minutes. In Moscow 16 swimmers finished in under 4 minutes and 8 of them did not make the final. Duncan Goodhue of Great Britain won the 100 meters breaststroke. Sweden's Bengt Barron won gold in the 100 meter backstroke. In the men's 4 times 100 meters medley relay each of the 8 teams taking part in the final broke its country's national record. The first Australian gold since 1972 came in the 4 times 100 men's medley relay with Neil Brooks swimming the final leg. The Australian swam the second fastest time in history. East German women dominated the swimming events, winning 9 of 11 individual titles, both the relays and setting 6 world records. They also won all 3 medals in 6 different races. In total they won 26 of the available 35 medals. As it was revealed later, their results were aided by the state-sponsored doping system. Barbara Kraus, East Germany, became the first woman to go under 55 seconds for the 100m freestyle. Backstroker Rika Reinisch, East Germany, was 20th in the world rankings for 100m in 1979 and not in the top 100 for the 200m. At the Olympics she broke the world records in both distances winning golds. In the 100 meters butterfly Karen Mechuk, East Germany, beats her more experienced teammate Andrea Pollock to win gold. Petra Schneider, East Germany, shaved three seconds off the world record in the 400 meters medley. As in Montreal the Soviet women made a clean sweep of the medals in the 200 meters breaststroke. The title in this event was won by Lena Kaciusite. Michelle Ford, Australia, won the 800 meters freestyle more than four seconds ahead of her East German rivals. In swimming 230 national, 22 Olympic and 10 world records were set. The youngest male gold medalist of these Olympics was Hungarian backstroke swimmer Sandor Vladar, 17 years and one week old. Topic. Volleyball The prominent nation in both volleyball competitions was the USSR, its teams won both golds. Topic. Water polo Hungary won a bronze medal in water polo. This continued their run of always winning a medal in this event since 1928. Topic. Weightlifting The standard of weightlifting was the highest in the history of the Olympics. There were 18 senior world records, two junior world records, more than 100 Olympic records and 108 national records set. The oldest of weightlifting's Olympic records, the snatch in the lightweight class set in 1964 was bettered 13 times. Yurik Vardanyan USSR became the first middleweight to total more than 400 kg, he won gold. In the super heavyweight class Vasily Alexeyev USSR Olympic champion at Munich and Montreal, eight-time world champion, who in his career set 80 world records, failed to medal. Soviet weightlifters won five golds. The new category in weightlifting, up to 100 kg, was won by Ota Zaremba of Czechoslovakia. Wrestling 
In Greco-Roman wrestling Ferenc Coxus of Hungary was declared the winner of the 163-pound class when the defending champion Anatoly Baikov was disqualified for passivity. Soviet wrestlers won 12 golds. Topic. Closing ceremony Because of the U.S. boycott, changes were made to the traditional elements of the closing ceremony that represent the handover to the host city of the next Summer Olympics in Los Angeles. Among them, the flag of the city of Los Angeles instead of the United States flag was raised, and the Olympic anthem instead of the national anthem of the United States was played. There was also no Antwerp ceremony where the ceremonial Olympic flag was transferred from the mayor of Moscow to the mayor of Los Angeles, instead the flag was kept by the Moscow city authorities until 1984. Furthermore, there was no next host city presentation. Both the opening and closing ceremonies were shown in Yuri Ozarov's 1981 film O. Sport, You Are the World. Russian, O Sport Time. Topic venues Central Lenin Stadium Area Grand Arena Squared Opening, Closing Ceremonies, Athletics, Football, Final, Equestrian, Jumping Individual, Minor Arena Squared Volleyball Swimming Pool Squared Water Polo Sports Palace Squared Gymnastics, Judo Druzhba Multipurpose Arena Volleyball Streets of Moscow, Athletics 20 and 50 km Walk, Marathon, Olympijski Sports Complex Indoor Stadium Basketball, Final, Boxing Swimming Pool Swimming, Diving, Modern Pentathlon, Swimming, Water Polo, Final, CSKA, Central Sports Club of the Army, Sports Complex CSKA Athletics Fieldhouse, Central Sports Club of the Army Wrestling CSKA Football Fieldhouse, Central Sports Club of the Army Fencing, Modern Pentathlon, Fencing, CSKA Palace of Sports Basketball Venues in Metropolitan Moscow Dynamo Central Stadium, Grand Arena Squared Football Preliminaries Dynamo Central Stadium, Minor Arena Squared Field Hockey Young Pioneers Stadium Squared Field Hockey Final Dynamo Palace of Sports, Kinky Kovrino, Handball Trade Unions Equestrian Complex Equestrian, Modern Pentathlon Tathlon, Riding, Running, Ismailovo Sports Palace Weightlifting Sokolniki Sports Palace Squared Handball, Final, Dynamo Shooting Range Squared, Midishi, Shooting, Modern Pentathlon, Shooting, Kralatskoy Sports Complex Kralatskoy Sports Complex Canoeing and Rowing Basin Squared, Kralatskoy, Canoeing, Rowing Kralatskoy Sports Complex Velodrome, Kralatskoy, Cycling, Track, Kralatskoy Sports Complex Cycling Circuit, Cycling, Individual Road Race, Kralatskoy Sports Complex Archery Field, Kralatskoy, Archery Venues Outside Moscow Moscow Minsk Highway, Cycling, Cycling, Road Team Time Trial, Kirov Stadium Squared, Leningrad, Russian SFSR, Football Preliminaries Dynamo Stadium Squared, Minsk, Belarusian SSR, Football Preliminaries Republican Stadium Squared, Kiev, Ukrainian SSR, Football Preliminaries Olympic Regatta in Tallinn, Tallinn, Soviet Occupied Estonia, Sailing New Facilities Constructed in Preparation for the Olympic Games. Squared Existing Facilities Modified or Refurbished in Preparation for the Olympic Games. Topic. Medals awarded The 1980 Summer Olympic program featured 203 events in the following 21 sports. Topic. Calendar All times are in Moscow time UTC plus 3. Topic. Medal count This is a list of all nations that won medals at the 1980 Games. Asterisk host nation, Soviet Union. Topic: List of participating countries and regions. In the following list, the number in parentheses indicates the number of athletes from each nation that competed in Moscow. Nations in italics competed under the Olympic flag or, in the cases of New Zealand, Portugal and Spain, under the flags of their respective national Olympic committees. See also 1980 Summer Paralympics 1980 Winter Paralympics 1980 Winter Olympics Olympic Games celebrated in Russia 1980 Summer Olympics, Moscow 2014 Winter Olympics, Sochi Olympic Games with significant boycotts 1976 Summer Olympics, Montreal, African boycott 1980 Summer Olympics, Moscow, United States-led boycott 1984 Summer Olympics, Los Angeles, Soviet-led boycott Summer Olympic Games Olympic Games 
International Olympic Committee List of IOC country codes Use of performance-enhancing drugs in the Olympic Games 1980 Moscow